Bringing the community together. From the home of Real Community Radio, this is 102.8 Chorley FM News. In the Sky News Centre at 8, a former army colonel says the UK's duty of care to its servicemen, war veterans and their families should be written into law. Details have emerged of a new military covenant. Defence Minister Andrew Bovethon has told the Daily Telegraph the coalition would ensure the best possible treatment. Conservative MP and former Colonel Patrick Mercer says it can't happen soon enough. Think Things have gone wrong in the past, of course they have. We've been at war now for 10 years and we need to have a properly legal binding statute which says that those who have bled for their country and their families will be properly looked after. Animal rights campaigners have criticised ministers for failing to bring in a ban on wild animals being used in circuses. Instead, the new proposals will see circus owners forced to apply for a licence to use performing animals. Several hundred people have taken part in a protest outside Westminster, described as a rally against debt. The group called for more government spending cuts. In football, both sides of Manchester are celebrating this evening. City's 35-year wait for a major trophy is over. They've won the FA Cup after beating Stoke 1-0 at Wembley. Manchester City boss Roberto Mancini says it's great news for everyone at Eastlands. It's very important for our players because I think that uh, for a club like City, Manchester City that uh, didn't win for a long time, win now in the, after to beat United in the semi-final, I think that is very important. Meanwhile, Manchester United have now become league champions more times than any other team in England. They clinched the title with a one-all draw at Blackburn. There were also wins for Wolves, Blackpool and West Brom. In the SPL, Hibernian went down 3-1 at home to Aberdeen. Already relegated, Hamilton lost to Inverness. The game between St Mirren and St Johnston ended goalless. And love it or loathe it, the Eurovision Song Contest is getting underway in Dusseldorf. Boy band Blue are representing Britain. That's the latest. I'm Chloe Culpin. You think you'd wake in a house fire? You'd smell the smoke and get out? Think again. Make sure your smoke alarm works. Test it weekly. Fire kills. You can prevent it. Are you part of an unsigned band? Send your CD to The Flat Iron Show, Chorley FM, Railway Road, Chorley, PR6, 0HW, or email flatiron at chorley.fm. The Challenge, 100 kilometres in 30 hours. Take a few steps into the unknown in support of Sue Ryder to complete the Ribbleway Challenge in June. We want teams of four to walk the equivalent of three marathons in under 30 hours and raise at least £250 per walker. Event partners Boland Pennine Mountain Rescue Team will be supporting you every step of the way. £250 provides a nurse for 30 hours in one of our Sue Ryder centres and hospices. To find out more and register online, go to suerider.org for slash Ribbleway. Entry fee of £25 applies. If you're going abroad by plane, boat, or the family car, there's one essential thing to do before you go. When you start planning your trip, check the expiry date on your European health insurance card. That's the card that entitles you to free or reduced cost healthcare in most European countries. Check your card's expiry date. Visit nhs.uk slash healthcareabroad or call 0845 606-2030. Bon voyage! Yo, I'm here with the Travel Supermarkets to let you know the Travel Supermarket is here to find the nation their ideal vacation. Saving lonely on your summer holiday. Oh yeah, baby! Travel Supermarkets search thousands of holidays from the big holiday names. Find your perfect trip with a click, click, click. To get the holiday of your dreams, go to travelsupermarket.com. Oh, turn up the heat, beach babes. Save super amounts of money. Travel Supermarket. Your local blood bank is running low on blood groups O negative and B negative. Visit blood.co.uk to find your nearest venue. Please, don't leave it to someone else. Give blood. Now. Now, more music and local news for South Lancashire. Real local radio for South Lancashire. 102.8 Charlie Evans. Scouse House Jammers. Scouse House Jammers. With DJ Thorny on 102.8 Charlie FM.
evening and a big warm welcome to the Scarce House Jammers with myself, the DJ Thorny, mixing up two hours of the very best in Scarce Bounce and Donk. Classic set for you tonight. A few of you have been asking me to dig out the old stuff. So this one goes out to you lot. Oh, you enjoy it. There's some good ones coming up. Looking forward to it myself. If you like a show tonight, contact the studio on 07 903 100 100. Start your message with the letters CFM. Leave the space. And then your message, I request. Text to church at your normal standard rate. But of course, send me the email, studio at charlie.fm. Sit back and enjoy the show. The weekend's here. It's time to party. Thank you. 
makes me turn around.
is what I be living. Fantastic, never heard nobody would ever choose the yelling. When the everyday gets on your last one, give it up and go. To the place in everyone's future. The good life, good life. one day will know. One day we'll know.
Tour.
Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a jam, a man, then he twirled ever since the proof is in the print and I'm pressed off a label ever then. Slam a 
the system, go with the flow. If you're looking for an attitude, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow. If you're looking for an attitude, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow. If you're looking for an attitude, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow. If you're looking for an attitude, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow. If you're looking for an attitude, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow, can't beat the system, go with the flow. If you're looking for an attitude, go with the flow, can't beat the system. Online. This is Surely FM. Hello, are you speaking to Jan? To Lucy. To Helen. How can I help you? Well, if I can just take your reference number. No problem, that's absolutely fine. We'll get that sent out to you straight away. As long as you have the skills to do the job, your age is irrelevant, which is why age discrimination in the workplace is now unlawful. Laws are in place to ensure that it's your ability, not your age, that's important. To find out more, Visit direct.gov.uk slash age discrimination. OK, that's lovely. Anything else I can help you with? OK, thank you. Goodbye. If you're going abroad by plane, boat, or the family car, there's one essential thing to do before you go. When you start planning your trip, check the expiry date on your European health insurance card. That's the card that entitles you to free or reduced cost healthcare in most European countries. Check your card's expiry date. Visit nhs.uk slash healthcareabroad or call 0845 606 2030. Bon voyage! From the home of Real Community Radio, this is 102.8 Chorley FM News. From the Sky News Centre at nine, David Cameron is expected to meet a pre-election commitment to enshrine government care for military personnel in law. The Prime Minister has been accused of diluting the military covenant after only legislating to review how well the government was looking after forces personnel in an annual Commons debate.